friend of mine I played golf with a lot recommended me the Ambassador Bundle end of last year. So I took a gamble and ordered all the tops in large. Then went and bought the shoes around Christmas. I got some shorts and an additional pair of trousers. Then more recently I bought three polos for 50 quid. One of them was already open a little bit. But it was cool. It's clearly a return. Not a problem. The large sizing is probably right for me. 86 kilos, 6 for 1, slightly dad bod frame. The models on the Instagram and stuff are wearing mediums, I believe. So the spotted shirt and the performance teal have got very similar material makeup. It's quite a silky feel in contrast to the other two I've got. Blue one's brilliant, more polyester in it apparently. More of a typical polo shirt feel, really nice. And the only reason I've gone and bought three more polo tops is because the first one I bought, this white one, was pretty good, pretty happy with it. So as you can see, this one's had a few washes. Collar's still, still an all right nick. It's that sort of dry fit material, which is quite cool. Silky material is just less rigid, so you wonder if the collar's gonna last or just curl up all the time after a few washes. But so far, so good. So then we have the jacket in the mid layer. The jacket's had a few washes, still looks all right. Other than a few loose threads, it's lasting well, no complaints. Sizing wise, this goes for the mid layer as well. Slightly on the loose side, but probably designed that way for the extra layer underneath that you'd want maybe. I wouldn't want the sleeves to be any shorter either. Now the mid layer's suffered with some wear, but I've got a theory about that. I think the jacket, when I've been wearing it, because it's shorter than the mid layer, it's constantly rubbed against it. Obviously not quite as premium and look and feel as my Under Armour, but pretty good. So the trousers and shorts all share the same consistency with the material and the elastic inside, which is quite nice, wide elastic. And how better to end than with some photos that my four-year-old daughter took after stealing my phone. Hope that helps if you're thinking of buying any of this gear or not. Give it a thumbs up if it was any good. And let me know in the comments if it was rubbish.